New at 6, Hemlock Public Schools is unveiling its big plans for the future. The school district is showing off how its learning landscape will change with projects impacting students, teachers, and even parents. TV5's Lenita Brooks studies up on what's to come in Hemlock. At Hemlock Public School District, we pride ourselves in, in being innovative and collaborative. And to keep at it, their buildings will receive some new upgrades. Today, the district unveiled its new master site plan. It is focused on creating safe spaces for kids and for our families, better traffic flow, uh, more security, uh, richer learning environments for our students where they, they feel comfortable, welcoming. The plan includes the renovation and expansion of existing facilities, the construction of a theater, competition gym, and addressing the traffic congestion around the district schools, something the superintendent Don Killingback says is top priority. We're going to be adding a, a drive into the building um, off a new roadway. Uh, the roadway, the base is already set. It's exciting. I was out there today. It re reroutes traffic, makes things safer and better and smoother for pickup and drop off. This playground that you see behind me will become a parking lot and the playground will be relocated away from the road. So parents can get off the road, park their car, and then drop off their kids. And so we're really excited about that because it's gonna be better for everyone involved. That'll happen um, this next uh, couple months. And so when we come back in August to school, that will be done. As far as the rest of the renovation, he says it's going to take a few years before everything on paper becomes a reality. And it's going to be a, not without headache and not without refinement. So we're getting the, the, the bones in place, and then we'll continue to work on that. In Hemlock, Lanita Brooks, WNEM TV5. Most of the project will be funded by the district's bond, but it's still looking to raise additional funds to cover the rest.